Hey guys, Jess here from Tonkadale, and today I want to present to you the beautiful poinsettias that we grow each season. We start these poinsettias in July as a rooted cutting and then grow them on to be the big beautiful plants that you see here today. The red or the color that you see on poinsettias is not really a flower. It's actually a bract or a modified leaf, which is signaled to color up after the autumnal equinox as the days get shorter and the nights get longer. Anyway, they do have flowers. The flowers are born here in the middle of the bract and that's called the cyathea and they will gradually open in your warm home. Poinsettias are really easy to care for if you follow a few simple tips. They like to be evenly moist. If they dry out too much, they will wilt and lose their bottom leaves. But don't worry, giving them a good soak will revive them. So you'll just lose some of those bottom leaves. Poinsettias really don't like to be out in the cold. That's why we wrap them in nice and snugly before you take them home. When they're in the home, they don't like to be near a cold draft, a cold window, or near a heater vent. So they basically dislike all HVAC. Last tip, if you do have them in a basket or a container, make sure they're never sitting in standing water. I usually take mine to the sink, water it thoroughly, and let it drain out the bottom so that it feels nice and heavy and the soil is wet like a sponge. And then I put it back in its decorative container or basket and enjoy long into the new year. Guys, check out my sweater. I found this in my grandma's closet this summer after she passed. She wore it nearly every holiday season here in the greenhouse and it is still as white as the day she bought it. I hope I can fill these sleeves and continue the legacy of the poinsettia sweatshirt from this day forward. Thanks for watching and we'll see you at Tonkadale.